I am so excited to introduce you to a group of brilliant young people from New York City, Team Feel Temple. As part of our COVID-19 virtual design challenge, these high schoolers created a wellness app that helps provide people with the tools they need to improve their mental health. They were excited to share their innovation with VIP coach Brandis Daniel, the founder of Harlem's Fashion Row. The app that me and my team members made was Field Temple, and I live in New York. I am a high school senior, and I go to Bronx Engineering and Technology Academy. Um, I'm a senior, I'm 17 years old. These students have been working hard on their innovation while adapting to what passes for normal during this pandemic. We had like visions, we had things that we wanted to do, but because of COVID, now we're stuck home and we can't go anywhere. So we were thinking like, Everybody must be in a you know a plummeted situation where they have like their energies their energy is very low. So we wanted to make like an app that you know uplifts you. Me personally, I feel like there are a lot of people who are going through this, and having that thought of not you know being alone and having others share that experience with you, like it gives you a little bit of you know motivation. Having that community around me in terms of like friends and all this, I feel like it really pushed me and kept me going because I I thought of a bigger thing than myself like. I realized what I was doing this for, not only for me, but for my family as well. So it gave me that drive to continue pushing. You know? Today, they're joined by Brandis Daniel, founder and president of Harlem's Fashion Row. Our goal with Harlem's Fashion Row is to connect designers of color to retailers. And we do that by doing really cool collaborations such as our Nike and LeBron James collaboration that we sneaker that we brought to life um, a couple years ago. Um, in addition to a collaboration that we have coming up with Banana Republic. Let's see what Field Temple has created. We created Field Temple for the sole purpose of giving people an inclusive community, a place where they can express themselves without feeling confined or judged. What is Fuel Temple, you may ask? Well, let me tell you. Fuel Temple is an app that helps you explore your emotions, learn new things about yourself, and collaborate with others to enhance your well being during tough times. As Bjorn said early on, we want to know what makes you you? What makes you happy? What are the things you like to do? This is what Fuel Temple is all about. Moving on to the personal survey, to go deeper in depth about you, we want to know what's your muse, basically your interests, sports, and music. Field Temple then wants to know how you're feeling, so be prompting you with questions and emojis to let them know. Alongside Mood Thermometer is your progress, which records your emotions every day and shows you at the end of the month for improvement. One of our app users is fascinated with basketball, so they were feeling down a certain day and we wanted to give them an inspirational quote from arguably the greatest basketball player of all time, Michael Jordan. Another one of our app users loves music, so we gave them an inspirational quote from the incredible artist known as Kanye West. Field Temple then has a section that allows for one-on-one -on -one time with youth counselors to help with personalized attention. Field Temple also has another section that allows their clients to have breathing exercises sent to them to help with short-term stress relief. At the end of your app usage, you're prompted with the final survey, which asks you, how do you feel after today's session? What is something new you learned about yourself or someone else? And how would you rate today's experience on a scale of one to 10 and why? We will fortify your mental state. Thank you. That was incredible. Incredible. Wow. I love it. What kind of sponsors do you see being totally into this? Uh, quick names, LeBron James, probably like Kevin Hart. I think he's a, you know, he's a big, Big fan of like mental health and all that. The Rock as well. Uh, yeah, just big influencers right now that are like, you know, motivational. And okay, so tell me about entrepreneurship. Is that something that you see for your life? Ever since I was a freshman, I've been introduced to Build and they gave us an opportunity to create our own products. And ever since like that creation and like just being able to create something for yourself, seeing it flourish, like, we sold 50 of them for $10 each. And like, that was really exciting. 
So ever since then, I, I wanted to meld like some type of technology with entrepreneurship. I love that the app, you can do good and have a business as well, right? A lot of times we think that they have to be separate, but you can have a business that does good and doesn't necessarily mean that it has to be a nonprofit, right? And so HFR, my company is not a nonprofit, but we are a business that do good. I'm really cautious about my friend group, about the people who are around me, about the team that I put around me. And you guys are building your team now. You know, even as teenagers, like the people who you keep close in your space, that's your team. And, you know, there's this saying that you're the average of the five people you spend the most time with. And so you get to, you can't choose family. Family is family, we love family. But you do get a chance to choose who are those other five people that you spend the most time with um, because they're gonna have a really big impact on like how far you go. Hi, my name is Bjorn Etienne and I am a part of Gen E. I am part of Generation Entrepreneur. I am Gen E, the new generation of entrepreneurs.